Hello again, Boxing World, and welcome to another edition of Fantasy Bout Hour, the channel dedicated to bringing you fantasy matchups on a regular basis. If there's a particular matchup that you want me to cover, please leave it in the comment section, and I promise to honor your request. Don't forget to subscribe and to hit the bell notification. The fight that I'll be bringing to you in this video comes by way of request, and it is coming from Stephen McBroom. I thank you for yet another great one. And the fight that he mentioned is a great one, because both of these fighters were similar. And that is Jermel Charlo versus terrible Terry Norris. And what a tremendous fight. I look at these fighters as mirror images of one another. They have, they have the same type of snapping jab, same type of straight right hand, and just their stances. Everything is the same, basically. Um, Jermel Charlo is the modern day Terry Norris, as far as I'm concerned. Sometimes I wonder if Terry Norris was his inspiration. Um, I wouldn't be surprised. Um, but anyway, what a tremendous fight. Um, I see Jermell having more confidence going in. But, you know, he's not going in there to bully Terry. He's not going in there to intimidate Terry. I mean, they call Terry terrible for a reason. They call him terrible for a reason. Um, I could see this fight being a jabbing contest. Um, so um, this is not a fight for people who want to see Slugfest all the time. I'm going to tell you that. Um, for those of us um, who are boxing purists, for those, excuse me, for those of us who are boxing purists, um, we would love this fight. You know, it would be a tactical fight. I mean, it would be a jabbing contest, you know, until somebody decides to unload that right hand first. Who would it be? Um, maybe Terry. Maybe Terry. Um, I feel that Terry had quicker hands. You know, of course, Terry has the better resume, but Charlo's career is not over yet. Um, hopefully he'll get in there with more, more of the top guys. Um, I think that Terry has a better snapping jab, you know, a quicker straight right hand. And that's another thing. This fight would be a battle of the one-two combination. And I love the one-two combination. Um, there's nothing like a fighter who has a great one-two combination. So that's what this fight would be. And so um, this would be a boxing match. It wouldn't be a slugfest. And um, both of these guys you know, had decent footwork. I'll just say both of them had, had good footwork. And um, I feel that Charlo has more power than Norris did. Who has the better stamina? Who has the better stamina? Um, I would say that Charlo probably has the better stamina um, because Charlo is one of those fighters um, who's more dangerous as the fight progresses. He's more dangerous in the later rounds than he is on um, the first rounds. Um, sometimes Charlo can be a slow starter, um, but he wasn't against Lubin. He wasn't against Lubin. So, um, man. Both of these fighters are mirror images of each other. Um, both of these guys have great snapping jabs, great quick straight right hands. And both guys are tough. Um, Charlo may be dur more durable and as I mentioned, um, maybe a little more stronger than Norris. So um, can I be honest with you? I really can't call this one. Um, I really can't. I can't, I can't, I can't. Um, so in that case, I'm just going to go with experience. And of course, that's Terry Norris. Um, he's fought the he's fought the better level of opposition and um, he's just more proven. So um, please let me know what you think on this one and I will see you on the next video. Yeah.